Because look how small that is. Like, what am I supposed to do with that? Now, with some jeans, I think it's fine. Them showing with, like, a skirt? Uh, possibly not. Welcome back to my channel, guys. It's your girl, Coco Styles. And on this channel, we talk about beauty, fashion, lifestyle, and styling, guys. So today, I have a quick, small haul for you guys. I told you guys that I did purchase another Ruslan Boginski hat. That finally came. So with the shipping with them, it doesn't seem like it's taking long, in my opinion. So that had I purchased, all I know is that it came in like seven days. So if you do decide to buy anything from their actual website, the shipping seems to be moving okay. So I have a few items for you guys. Now the first item are a pair of shoes that I got from some random brand guys called nice pair now hear, hear me out as a girl who got some big old feet i was a little nervous <laughs> about the shoe but they were genuine leather just a small little kitten heel and i know what you're saying kitten heels are so ugly blah 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 but i wanted to try them out because they were genuine leather um, I did have a pair of kitten heels. This was many, many years ago. And to be quite honest, they were very uncomfortable. The heel was just way too low. It just didn't do anything for me. Like, my feet were hurting. Just, it wasn't comfortable. So, I thought I'd give them a try again with a pair of slingbacks. I did put a pair of slingbacks in my fashion radar video. These are black, though. I wanted to go with a color that... I knew they couldn't mess up, if that makes sense. So I wasn't too sure if the shoes were coming from... I didn't know where they was coming from. But they did come from China. So sometimes the things made in China are made smaller. So I just wanted to check it out. And the brand is called... The, the site is called Nice Pair. They do, up, they do go up to a size... I think I saw a size 14 on there. But the actual brand of the shoe is called Funny She Jill. I have no idea. Can you guys see that? It's probably coming up backwards. Uh, <laughs> let me show y'all. Now, they fit fine. Like, they kind of look a little shiny for me. Um, they do smell like leather. Um, <laughs> so, that's a good thing. Just a nice little... I mean, the kitten is kittening. Okay? Because look how small that is. Like, what am I supposed to do with that? Now, with some jeans, I think it's fine. Them showing with, like, a skirt? Uh, possibly not. But if you do buy, like, a pair of wide leg jeans or pants, definitely get these. They have a ton of colors. Like, a ton of colors. A pretty red pair. And this little part right here is so soft. Like, it's really, it's like a cushion going up and down the whole shoe. Like I said, they were $125. They smell like leather. They say genuine leather. And I think they're, they're cute. They have a pretty red color, a pretty yellow color, fuchsia, maybe like a teal color. Um, I didn't see white. But they just had a ton, a ton of colors. Both of the shoes. Some little cute little... <laughs> Kid heels. I don't know. I'm going to keep them. If I don't wear them, I'm just going to sell them because they are rather pointy. Like really pointy. But this is a size 12 and they fit. To me, they fit true to size. Um, well, let me not say that because I'm technically, I'm technically smaller than this. But I would say cool. The bottom looks like this. Um, it's kind of like... I don't even know what to call this bottom. Wood? Would y'all hear that thunder? I'm going to the nail salon. I don't care. Um, but yeah, some cute little sling bags. And I'm only saying this now. These are I don't even where's my measurement tape in the other room. I know for sure that I need something slightly higher. I'm gonna try it out just to see, but these are the shoes that I purchased. Um, they're so pointy. Oh my gosh. Um, <laughs> um, and again, the brand is called Funny. 
F-U-N-N-Y, she, S-H-E, and then Jill, J-I-L-L. And the website is called Nice Pairs. These were the only ones that I saw that were 100% leather. But like I said, they have, you know what? Let me grab all the colors that they have for you guys. So they have black, a pretty green. I'll show the pictures of them. A pretty green, like a teal color, fuchsia, um... The fuchsia looks brighter in the actual photo from like a customer. They have red. And they also have purple. And then black. So fuchsia, purple, red, green, teal, yellow, and black. 125. I think they're fine. <laughs> Y'all know for those of you girls who have larger feet, it's really hard for us to find like cute shoes. Like I said, sometimes a kitten heel can be uncomfortable and may look a little weird on, but they fit fine. But I don't know if it's gonna be my cup of tea because the heel is super tiny. So that'll be 125. I'm not gonna say down the drain, I'll probably sell them if I needed to. Um, the other item, the Ruslan Baginski hat. So they're sending back my other two, which I'm super glad. And I looked at my receipt, not receipt, like my return stuff. They may possibly be sending me an extra hat. I'm not 100% sure, but I will see. And if I do, I'll let you guys know. So this is the white one that I was telling you guys. So this is the white and wool. The white and wool which I love. And this is in an extra large. All right, so this is in the extra large. Absolutely love these hats. I told you before, my debacle with trying to order them, but I was finally able to get the ones that I wanted that have been on my list for forever. So the white wool, this is going to go really nice with my Frankie Shop coat. If you guys know about that jacket, it's really pretty and it's really long. Um, so yeah, so that's the hat. I said this last time, the hats did go up in price. So listen, if you don't need an extra large, try to get them from like the other websites because they do still have a really nice um, sale on them. All right, so let's grab my let's grab my last item okay this was on my fashion radar list okay I'm gonna say Caperni unless somebody corrects me um the heart bag it does come inside its own dust bag like all bags the original price of the bag was $5.40. I did not pay that because it was on sale at Neiman Marcus. Okay. But here is the bag. It's a really, really, really nice bag. I'm going to back up just a smidget so you guys can actually see the full bag. It's a really nice bag. So, one thing I said before about the bag is that it's very flat. So, if you decide to put anything in it, you don't want it to be, like, bulky. So, maybe, like, a small, um, a card, a wall card wallet, wallet card, card wallet, um, your keys, possibly, like, some lip gloss, maybe a flat mirror, um, you know, nothing too crazy where it's going to bulk out the bag. It's very nice. Very nice bag. It's unique. It's different. The opening is not really large. So you guys can see that. It's not a really large opening. But again, it is a really flat bag. So Neiman Marcus had the bag for three something, I want to say. It was three something. I'm almost 100% sure. And it may still be on sale, to be quite honest with you. You guys can see how narrow it is from here. It's just a cute, trendy bag. 
nice little trendy bag. And their name is like slightly printed at the bottom corner, which is cool. It's not all over the bag. But a really, really nice, quick little haul for you guys today. So things that were on my fashion radar list was this bag. And that is it that was on my fashion radar list. But let me know what you guys think about the items. They have this bag in red, I said, and a patent leather. It's a smaller version. This is the, the medium, midi. And then they also have it in a denim color that is this size. A taupe color that is this size. Of course, black. And I want to say that that's it. But they're really cute. They're different. Just something to just throw on when you want to go out side really quick i may actually throw it on today but it is pouring rain and i need my nails done but that's it guys just three items today the hat the shoes and the bag sometimes when i do hauls you may see me do things that are like full-on clothes or just pieces that i found and as a tall girl you guys already know for us Trying to accessorize um, and finding shoes and stuff can be a little bit harder for us. Not so much the accessories, but finding nice accessories is kind of hard. And when I mean by accessories, I mean your hats, your jewelry, anything that's added onto your outfit to make it pop. So hats is something that I absolutely love and so are cute, unique bags. It doesn't matter if the bag is like a high-end designer or something that I think it's really nice as far as the quality or even the silhouette of the bag. So if you're trying to add on to your wardrobe, you don't necessarily always have to buy something that is $4,000. You can buy something that's $300 or $400 if it works well with your wardrobe. And when it comes to the shoes, y'all already know the struggle with the feet, honey. But they're cute. I'm going to see if I'm going to wear them. If I, if I wear them and I don't like them, I'm going to sell them on Poshmark. Okay. Um, but what I may do with them is put something on the bottom to avoid. There is a grip there, but I don't know how good that grip is. I don't know. But like I said, they do look patent leather, but online they don't look patent leather. And that's your little tiny heel, child. Right there. What's that, like a half an inch? That's like an inch. <laughs> but I don't know if they look like rather they do look kind of long they do look kind of long now that I'm looking at them in the mirror they do look kind of long but we shall see if I keep them if not I'll be selling them guys thank you guys for tuning into this quick haul today with your girl Coco um, so this is kind of like shopping while tall guys when it comes to shoes and when it comes to buying accessories and stuff so shopping while tall and quick little haul for you guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you guys are following me on instagram at coco styles nyc and coco styles ny and if you stay to the end of this video please comment coco we see you and guys don't forget to check me out on my blog coco styles nyc.com and my style services coco styles ny.com and i'm on tickety tickety talk coco styles nyc Coco Styles NYC and I will catch you guys in the next. Bye guys.